On the Logitech G515 Rapid TKL, you can configure the actuation point and rapid trigger without G-Hub using the customizable analog profile. So here's how you do it. Enter the customizable analog profile by pressing FN plus F5. The F5 key's backlight will now turn cyan. Press FN plus F6, which shows the default settings in blue. Use the arrow keys to increase or decrease the setting. Alternatively, you can directly select the desired value by pressing on the numerical keys. Press any key to test the setting. The number keys will illuminate from left to right, indicating the pressure needed to actuate the key. To save and exit, press FN plus F6, or you can press Escape to exit without saving. Enter the customizable analog profile by pressing FN plus F5. The F5 key's backlight will now turn cyan. Press FN plus F7 to enter rapid trigger settings, which shows the default settings in pink. Now, press F7 key again to enable slash disable rapid trigger. While enabled, the F7 key blinks rapidly. Once enabled, use the arrow keys to increase or decrease the setting. Alternatively, you can directly select the desired value by pressing on the numerical keys. Press any key to test the setting. When pressed and released, the key's lights turn blue when actuated and magenta when it resets. To save and exit, press FN plus F7 or you can press Escape to exit without saving. For per key customization and to adjust the rapid trigger's values in steps of 0.1 millimeter, check out our video linked below. If you have any questions or for more information, please feel free to reach out to us at our support site linked in the description. Thank you for joining, and I'll see you next time.